Hey, this is Ace Bangler, and this is episode 24 of Building Itter Castle in Lego. As you can see, we've gotten quite a bit of the castle done so far, probably over 40%, or at least pretty close to 50% at this point. Last segment, I was mainly just working on the keep here, putting in this window section, and doing a little bit more of the filler brick area and then I also put in the wall back there to enclose the courtyard completely so at this point you haven't been watching this segment you got about 40-45% uh, of the castle done like I said and then all the landscaping detail is done for the most part I still have a few grass pieces and leaves that I can make some trees that I might add later on well I will add later on it's just I guess I'm saving that for a time maybe when I run out of castle pieces so have at least something to do if I'm waiting for like a brickling cord or something like that and with that I think as far as this segment I'm planning on doing more keep work Hope maybe I'll get started because for the keep so far it's basically just that front wall. If you look back here, the back wall isn't, it really hasn't been started yet. It, we're just about starting on the spot right here. And other than that, as you can see, I, I'd need a lot more filler brick in there. Could put another, uh, I need to put a section of wall right here so I could do that also. But I think I might add one more window layer to the front here. Here's the window design I got. I just need to build a few more of these. And I probably could just put one more window layer on there for now. And then probably get started on the back. So I think that's most likely what I'll do, I'll probably right away start off with putting that uh, next window layer on and we'll see uh, how it goes from there. So with that, I stop talking and I'll get working. So let's go get working guys. progress as you saw in that time lapse I was working on the next level of the castle or more specifically the main keep and after looking at some pictures for some reason I thought there'd be uh, three sets of windows so, or at least three sets of these windows so one two and then another one up here I look closer at the, the pictures and I don't know why I thought there's three but there's only two at least in the front area so right after this layer there's going to be the roof right up here so there's not much uh, taller this section has to go so this section has the roof above the roof goes uh, farther back to about this point and then there's another like tall tower here if you've seen the pictures so this this area is almost up to it, the height it has to be at so I'll leave that um, leave that be for a little while until I get the other sides built up to be the same level and then after that I'll work on the roof but uh, if you saw earlier uh, everything else is kind of just there's no progress on the back little progress on this side and no progress on the the very back or that no progress that side the back little progress on this side the only really thing that has progress is the front which is what I was mainly working on before I sent out some uh, bricklink orders for some filler bricks so once that will get here probably next segment uh, I'll get working on filling in this whole side here this whole side 
I'll probably start working on the back next segment, but I could also use the filler brick to fill in the uh, the other side of the castle. So that leaves me with what I'm going to do now uh, with this side building that goes right here. Put this in place for you guys to get a better picture. So this goes here. If it will cooperate. There we go. This one goes here. And then you notice that there's this kind of gap right here that doesn't have anything. I'm going to go ahead right now and build the, the kind of wall slash kind of extension of this building and wall that will go right here and at least it'll be maybe this far over it won't be too big but enough to cover up this uh, wall that will be filler brick back here and connect to this one and it will kinda conjoin and then there will be like a wall that goes along here so I'll go ahead do that and yeah the bricklaying coder should they'll yeah, the, hopefully they'll get here next segment. It, they're mainly built up of just filler brick, but also a little bit of uh, the regular building supplies for castle. So you can expect that to come next segment. So for now, I'll work on this little side area, and we'll see how much uh, more time we have. To, uh, maybe we'll do a little bit more uh, keep work, but for now. I'll go ahead and get working on that side uh, building. this segment uh, as you saw in those time lapses I was working on this uh, kind of side building I guess or extension of this building and basically before it was just kind of a little hole I guess little spot that just needed to be filled in I couldn't really find pictures of what would actually be there so I kind of just built this little wall as you can see here and it's basically going to just cover up some filler brick of the keep until this point when you I'll start using detailed brick again. And then after that, what you didn't see in the time lapse was I extended this roof a little bit so it would meet up with the keep wall and, and kind of just made it so this wall met up with this uh, building here. And they both are removable. And you can kind of see here that they both meet up at the point here. You can zoom in for you guys. Give you a little better view. You can see the keep filler brick in the background there. It's kind of just got a rough edge where it meets up. There you can see it. And then the roof will continue to rest on this area and then this this section is removable as well let's put this back here fits in pretty nicely give you a, it's kind of just a little C 
seam right there. If it loads. It's pretty hard to tell which is oak, which is nice because then you can't tell that they're two separate buildings. So that's basically what I was just doing. And then yeah, I guess this segment, just to recap, went ahead, added the next and kind of final layer of windows, built that side building back there, and I sent out some bricklink orders for some filler brick, along with a few uh, more, uh, more detailed pieces for the outside of the castle. So that's going to leave me for, I guess that's going to be like all for this segment then waiting for those orders to come in. I'm two of the three shipped out already, so I'm pretty sure they're going to all come in in time, so that will be good. Next segment, we'll probably start off by uh, putting in a lot of the filler brick, and I think I'm going to start off, well, at least um, get working on this side of the keep here, get all the filler brick up, and then I'm planning on probably doing this back area of the the castle because I, I found some pictures of online of the back of the castle but no pictures so far of that the other side that I haven't even done any work on yet so that's gonna be the mystery side but since I found those pictures of the back of the castle I feel like that would be a good area to start and so pretty much the next segment some filler break uh, back area of the keep and then yeah so well also on a somewhat unrelated note I was doing a little bit of decaling and painting I guess I've been doing a lot of painting but found some time to get a little bit of decaling in and while doing these guys uh, a batch of five German a water slide decal just the regular German infantry it turned out really nice and I was doing a decal tutorial for you guys on these guys so that brings me on uh, to a question I have for you guys I've been recording a lot of uh, tutorial videos I have uh, recorded painting tutorial videos and then recently just this uh, decal tutorial video so my question to you guys is would you rather have me post the four part uh, uh, meaning four weeks in a row painting tutorial so next week the week after that the week after that and then the week after that or instead of the four week painting tutorial post the decal tutorial first that would only be a one week so basically I post the decal one for this week or I post the painting one and then you'll have to wait four weeks till you get the decal one so I guess it's just your personal preferences on whether you'd rather have the decal one or the four part painting one first. The painting one gets a little bit more complicated just because I started off with one video and then I feel like I felt like that I needed to uh, do a little bit more explaining so it ended up turning into a four part series. First video being kind of more on the supplies and full on overview of painting second video is the first coat third video is a uh, second coat of paint plus like uh, trying to fix errors and then the third uh, fourth and final video for painting series will be on the, the protective uh, varnish coat and then the decal video is just one decal video of me showing you uh, me just decaling one figure and giving you some helpful tips so I guess it's up to you guys just comment below I guess whichever one gets the most comments uh, uh, for me to do then I'll post that one this coming up uh, this Wednesday so with that end the segment out if you guys like what you saw please like comment subscribe shout us always help the channel and thank you guys for watching and I hope to see you guys in the next video